Shalom and blessings, warriors of Yahuwah and the truth. Um, if you haven't yet, please like, subscribe, and share down below. Um, I'm trying to get so Bella Bean you can be in the frame too. She likes to lay in my lap when I do videos. Um, okay, we are on video number 71 of Eden to Armageddon, Volume 1, Universal Consciousness. And there is also a donation link to my ministry for PayPal down in the description box. Um, and you can order or pre-order seat seats, and you can let me know how you want them, and you can order them with the same link. Universal Consciousness. Black arts are being increasingly used to induce unsuspected illumination on those who are not sealed in their foreheads with Yahuwah. Humans are ingesting forbidden fruit, which Yahuwah warned is sinful, and their doing such will result in terrible judgment. Satan knows this, but he is pushing his pills to so humanity will totally worship him as their savior without seeking redemption. A disillusioned population will jump at the chance to take his mark in their foreheads, with him further promising benefit to their flesh. This new way of thinking will include mankind's total acceptance of world government, global ec economic order, one world religion, global consciousness of tolerance, and becoming one uh, with a G.O.D. of forces whose image is C-H-R-I-S-T. <clears throat> They're going to use the blood of Yahusha to make a clone of um, of who all the Christians think is J-E-S-U-S, and they're going to have him, but he's really going to be Hashatan, Satan. The Illuminati's religious power is centered within the Vatican in Rome. Ongoing black mass rituals claimed by those who left the Jesuit order are said to be secretly conducted under the Vatican in a crypt located over an ancient oracle site that involves sacrificing children on an altar, as well as sexual acts with virgins. Like their father Satan, perverted sex causes the greatest trauma to humans and forever takes away innocence. Such evil is but a replay of Satan taking away Kua or Eve's innocence in the Garden of Eden. Average Catholics, just like members in Masonic lower levels, have no idea what is going on daily with Vatican hierarchy. New Age doctrines of Vatican's upper Ecleon are pushing global consciousness in order to evolve mankind toward awareness of divine nature with grand illusions of becoming GODs themselves or Allahim. On March 19, 2011, France's the, the country or the, uh, the country France, then President Nicolas Sarkozy, or Sarkozy appeared on CNN proclaiming France was going into Libya for universal consciousness under NATO and giving Libya back to its people. A no-fly zone has been placed on Libya earlier that week in an effort to stop Gaddafi from attacking his people. Without conversing with our governmental officials, Obama joined the NATO coalition so much for transparency, which he promised upon his election. It seemed NATO takes precedence over United States of America or any other country. Oh, they can't see you. Yet it's our taxpayers' money funding their universal consciousness. With serious economic downturns almost bankrupting our country, it, appear, it now appears NATO has power over America, regardless of our foreboding economic crisis. Even France was having economic unrest, yet Obama and Sarkozy made, made it sound like NATO had its own money when it, it is really taxpayers' money. Funding such Universal Consciousness several months later during August 2011 
dropped America to an AA credit rating and also threatened France's AAA rating, which they frantically saved by flashing, flashing their budget deficit. The last thing America and France needed was to fund NATO, yet it was done without governmental approval. Um, polls taken concerning America going after Gaddafi showed no one side one sided um, show that no one sided with Obama's decision. This is serious because elected officials are supposed to represent us, and that clearly is not being done. With intense fighting, extreme monetary expenditures, and loss of life, Gaddafi remained in power for months until his death. An evil agenda is behind what is happening worldwide. Satan has his illuminated followers believing they can rule the universe, never having to answer to the Yahuwah of creation or to, sim or to simple p little people who elected them to power. Mandating global consciousness through NATO or a United Nations Central Force to maintain a peaceful world by forming coalitions towards unification is how Satan makes rulers of countries his puppets. Next time we will be reading The Muslim Brotherhood Scam. But also remember, this is for entertainment purposes only. Okay, now, now it's kind of starting to hurt again, so I might not be able to make the next two videos. I hope you guys are okay with that. Um, just let me know in the comments, and if you would like tomorrow, I will do um, just one video from the Sefer readings, and I will do one video from the BYNB. Um, maybe I'll just, every other day I'll do the two, the, the these two books and then every other day I'll do the Sefer and the BYND. Um, so just let me know if that's what you guys want in the comments. Um, I am now going to sing a short praise to Yahuwah. Love you. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Until next time.